This video is just a short extract from the entire course. If you wish to see all of the videos from this series at higher quality and in far larger screen size, head over to ifskills.com. In this chapter, we're going to look at loading primitives into the scene. So as before, we'll start off with a new blank medium sized scene. And all of the primitives are contained within the first icon. Clicking that, you can scroll through the different primitives that are available. But if you click and hold, then you can get a drop down and quickly select the one that you're after. There are now several ways to add that to your scene. You can just click within the scene and it will add the primitive at the location that you click on. Just delete that. You can also drag the object into the scene and again it will be located to the position that you drag it to. You can use the insert menu. Cone this time and that will load it to the center of your scene. Probably the most versatile way of doing this, I'll select a sphere this time. We've selected the sphere, if we now click and drag within the scene, you can set the location, but then as we drag, you'll see that the size is also set. So that we can define not only the location, but the size of that particular primitive. There's also a size item within the list of properties available. So if you want to have it to a particular size, then it's easy to just define that within the properties list.